What's going on everyone? I'm Saint Villain. Welcome to another indie game. And this game is uh, one that I've had for a while. It's called 20 Games to Play with Your Mates. And it, it's just that. It's a really fun game. It's good for multiplayer. And I'm just going to show you by myself. Because uh, what it is, it, it is 20 different games. Some of them are good. Some of them need multiplayer. But the ones that don't are still fun to play by yourself. Because, uh, see, it has a high score at the bottom. My uh, gamer tag grip zone 14. I've got 949 on that, and some other ones. So, yeah, a lot of them are just kind of like classic games, and you know it's good to. Uh, I'll show you one. This was Acid Escape. Basically, you just jump up. The blocks are falling. It's so difficult to see. Sometimes a glitch happens and you float. Oh no, no, uh, and then you die. So imagine four, four, four or yeah, four people. So three of your friends. You know, just kind of. Uh, Jumping to see you can get higher. Oh crap, no. And sometimes you get blocked in. But <laughs> if I can get out, there we go. Oh, and then the, the pyramid forms, and then you're freaking stuck. So to get a high score, you kind of need to be lucky that you uh, get a good kind of run at it. Oh no. Oh, see, and then I die. <laughs> it's kind of disappointing. I used to be really good at that game. And then, you know, there's some games that aren't good that I don't like. This one's kind of like a. Uh, uh, what's it called? Jump Shores kind of thing. Sumo is terrible. I hate it. I suck at it. My friends always beat me. This one is definitely a fun thing to play. Especially with your friends and maybe you're drinking a little bit. Who knows? Basically, your spaceship flying around. I flew off screen by accident. Press A to go thrust and then just left stick to, yeah, to spin around kind of. Choose your direction. And you just want to fall on these uh, little pads. So when you have more people, you can like smack them into stuff, and uh, I'm a real dick when it comes when I'm playing this with, with my friends. So I just kind of smash them everywhere, and then once they're all dead, I land, and I land in style, as you can see. Okay, maybe not that much style, but always you always want to try and land on the smaller platform or land on the a platform first, and you get doubled points. Uh. That's key. Then you have this zombie one. Well, it's not zombies. It's uh, spiders, really. A uh, classic dice kind of strategy game. Difficult as crap. Uh, swing gems. Oh, sunken ruin. This one's fun. Play with friends. Oh, you do. Hit A. Oh, dang it. Okay. Yeah, I... Okay, I shouldn't have died there. My bad. So, I always choose the green guy. For this, it's not the greatest because... He kind of blends in with the background. But I'm always green, just cause. So basically, you just hit A, you jump in the castle, you jump, you have to keep jumping, it's unlimited. I think my friend actually has a high score on this. I might have tied with him. But this is one that we were... Oh, no, let's see. Yeah, it's mine. I have the high score, 65 meters. And same with... Oh! My friend beat me on this. Sky's falling, so fun. Sometimes you just stand here and nothing happens. But you're a little robot trying to avoid the rocks. My friend did it for like three minutes, I guess. No, I think that's actually my score, but I was on... I had a bunch of friends over, so we were passing the controller around. And, uh... Yeah, so... I think that's actually my record. Three minutes of just standing and avoiding rocks. Fun game? I like it. Like, my friends don't because... I don't know, I just seem to be really good at it. Or just lucky, really. I barely ever lose. I'm just, I actually sometimes try and get the. Uh, I screw around too much and then I get hit on the head with a rock. Which I probably should soon. Actually, I'll stop. I'll get a really good number. And then I'll just stop. Okay, never mind. That's not a good number. But whatever. Stop there. Then you have basically Connect 4, but I guess they're not allowed to call that. That's fun. It's only two player. Another one is. Another fun one is Swing Gems. Uh, kind of like if you ever played Worms, like Worms Revolution or Armageddon, kind of any one of those. You have the ninja rope, pretty much. And you just hit A, you kind of aim with your, oops, aim with the left stick, press A, swing, press A to release, and keep doing that. Basically, you want to get as far as you can. And, uh, fun thing to do, if you have friends, you just try and go as fast as you can. You just kind of catapult yourself. And then, uh, the screen always follows the person who's in first. 
So they get really screwed over if they don't go fast enough. So they yell at me. <laughs> yeah. Oh. So it really takes some technique. I got to 5,700 meters. Which, if you actually take the time to try these high scores, some of them are pretty difficult. Like this one. Oh, that was one of my friends. He got that. Play this uh, game on the... He has an iPhone. He plays it on that. It's tap A. Tap A. And you just go through. See if you can get a high score. Who can uh, win. And it's so weird. You know, you're kind of like a little helicopter kind of thing going through a cave. You know, we'd always say, like, why are we going through a cave? Especially with more people you're, you're like, following each other. You're like, this is a bad idea. Why are we in a cave? This is no shortcut. Kind of thing like that. It's always fun to play with friends. And um, I might actually do pretty good on this. Might not get close to that 600, uh, you know, high score my friend put on. Because he, he plays this game a lot. Not this one. Actually, he came over to my house once. He played 20 games to play with your mates. He went home and he actually downloaded it. And uh, so I think he was practicing, but and all is fair because me and some other friends have it, so we practice. So when we get together, it's kind of a competition to see who's better, and that that always makes the game more fun when uh, it's kind of a friendly competition. I'm doing decent, and as soon as I say that, I'm, oh no! Oh. I hope that didn't pick up on the mic. That seemed really loud. And now, no, that game kind of sucks. It's the same map every time. Okay, I'll, let's see if I can do better on uh, Acid Escape. Nope. All right, all right, we're going up. That's bad. Okay, got 60. Okay, stop it. The minimum you should get is 22 because that's how high your guy jumps. So if you don't get higher than that, or you don't get, uh, yeah, if you. Oh, what the? Okay. Now I'm doing terrible. Yay. Oh. Wow. Oh, crap. Do I, and then sometimes you get stuck. Crap. Hmm. Dungeon Diamonds, that's fun. You. It doesn't ever end. That's why it's fun. <laughs> it's kind of annoying at the same time. So, yeah, that's uh, 20 games to play with your mates. 20 games to play with your mates. Really fun indie game. It's been out for a while. Uh, if you haven't played it, you should. And, uh, you know, invite your friends over and play with them. And you will have a fun time. I'm pretty sure of it. So I'm Saint Villain. Thanks for watching. See you next video.